Well, what if I told you there was a guy that secretly likes you, but was too afraid to tell you or even talk to you at all? You can drop the act drift. I know that the guy is you. And don't worry, I like you too. Of course I'll go on a date with you. No, no, no. You've got this all wrong. Don't be shy and just kiss me, you big idiot. I can't believe this. Did Drift just kiss Vix? He stole my girl. I can't believe he would do this to me. Whoa! What the heck was that? A kiss, Drift. Isn't that what you wanted? I thought that was what you wanted from me, right? <laughs> I'm sorry, Vix, but this is kind of awkward. But I think you've got this all wrong. What are you talking about, Drift? You basically just told me you loved me, and now you're acting all weird. That's the thing. I was talking about Deadpool. I wasn't talking about me, Vix. Wait, what? So the guy thing you were talking about is actually Deadpool? And it was never you? Yeah, he's the one that's in love with you, not me. That's why he's being so awkward every time he talks to you. You mean the way he keeps freezing up and acting so strange? That's how he acts around someone he likes? Exactly. It's because he really likes you and finds it hard to tell you. He's really not as cool as he thinks. Wow. I'm sorry, Drift. I thought you were talking about you. Yeah, about that. You said you felt the same way, right? Is that true? Well, this is awkward. Yeah, I suppose I do like you, Drift. A lot. Well, that's not good. I'm sorry, Vix. You really are a great girl, but I just can't. I couldn't do it to Deadpool. Why? Because of Deadpool? But I don't even like him. It's you I like, not him. I'm sorry, Vix, but that doesn't matter. Me and you can never happen. Deadpool's one of my best friends, and I'd never betray him like that. I can't believe Drift would do this to me. Just betray me like this. He knows how much I like Vix, and then he just steps in and steals her? This means war. Like I said, Vix, I'd never betray Deadpool like that. He's my friend. I don't want to hurt his feelings. But Drift, I really like you. I can't just ignore those feelings. Well, you're gonna have to, Vix. I'm sorry. I gotta go. I'll see you later. But Drift, don't go! I can't believe this! I basically pour my heart out to Drift and he just says no? And it's all because of Deadpool! Hmm, I guess I'll just have to make him like me. Time to seduce Drift! <laughs> Uh, is that Deadpool? I wonder where he's going. Hey, Drift, where's Deadpool off to? I don't know, Wick. He never said anything. He just took off. I thought I made myself clear when I said no team members to go off on their own. Might as well be just waiting for an opportunity like this. I know. I don't know where he's gone, Wick. Then find out, Drift. Hey, look, I just got a text from Deadpool now. It says, meet me at Sweaty Sands for some ice cream, old buddy, old pal. Oh, fair enough. But be careful, you two. Like I said, might as well be just waiting for an opportunity to catch us off guard. Don't worry, Wick. We'll be careful. Good. Oh, man, Deadpool took the chopper. How am I meant to get to Sweaty Sands now? The old-fashioned way, Drift. Just take a boat. Ah, uh, lame. Fine. Uh, that's weird. The ice cream store is closed today. Why would Deadpool ask to meet me here? Yo, Drift, old buddy, old pal. <laughs> hey, Deadpool. How come you wanted to meet here? The ice cream store is closed. Oh, my goodness, you're right. How could I ask you to come all the way here knowing the ice cream store is closed? I'm such a bad friend. I'm sorry. 
Uh, are you okay, Deadpool? You're acting a bit strange. Oh, I'm fine, Drift. Never felt better. So tell me, how's my best friend doing? <laughs> yeah, I'm good, dude. Better if I had some ice cream. Deadpool, are you sure you're okay? Oh, yeah. It's like I said. I've never felt better. Well, except for one tiny, insy-bitty little thing. Oh, yeah? Anything I can do to help? Oh, I don't know, Drift. Maybe you can. Are you any good at removing daggers from people's backs? Okay, Deadpool. What the heck are you talking about, dude? The dagger in my back, Drift. The one you stuck there. Okay, so you've totally lost it, Deadpool. It's a metaphor, Drift. You stabbed me in the back. What? How? I didn't do anything. Oh, drop the act, Drift. I saw you and Vix hooking up. Wait, what? In the HQ. You guys kissed. I saw it, Drift. You can't deny it. Oh, you saw that? Wait, Deadpool, I can explain. This is just a big misunderstanding. You're gonna laugh when I tell you what happened. Oh, I'm not in the laughing mood, Drift. I'm more in the fighting mood. Whoa, 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 Deadpool, chill out, dude. Just let me explain what you actually saw. Oh, the time for talking is over, Drift. You betrayed your best friend. Uh-oh. Oh man, I didn't bring any weapons. I gotta get out of here before he kills me. Oh, you can run, Spiky, but you can't hide. Oh man, I can't believe Deadpool actually thinks I tried to steal his girl. I would never do that. I need to think of a way to prove to Deadpool that he's got this all wrong. I think I've got an idea how to prove to Deadpool that I wasn't trying to move in on his girl. I'm going to text Vix to meet me at the taco store in Retail Row. That way I can get her to tell Deadpool that this whole thing is one big misunderstanding. What was Drift talking about? I got it all wrong. I know what I saw. Drift and Vix kissed. There's no possible reasonable explanation for that. <sighs> I'll ask Vix what happened. Ooh, a text from Drift. And he wants me to meet him at the taco store in Retail Row? Oh, maybe Drift has finally come around to the idea of us dating. I can't believe this. I knew it. First, Drift kisses the girl I like. Then when I confront him about it, he asks her out on a date? Huh. I'm just gonna have to make this a date Drift will definitely remember. <laughs> oh, where the heck is Vix? What's taking so long? Hey there, handsome. It's good to see you've come around to the idea of us dating. What? No, that's not why I asked you here. I wanted to meet you here so I could ask you to talk to Deadpool. He saw you kiss me earlier, and now he's the total wrong idea. So what do you want me to say to him? You need to tell Deadpool that I wasn't trying to hook up with you, that it's all one big misunderstanding. So there's really no chance you could ever like me? Look, Vix, it's nothing to do with you. You're a great girl, and any guy would be lucky to have you as their girlfriend. But Deadpool is one of my best friends, and I can't do that to him. I understand, Drift. You really are a good friend. I'll talk to Deadpool and tell him the truth. You will? Oh man, that's great news. Because the last time I saw him, he basically tried to kill me. Wow, really? He must really be cut up about it. Yeah, he is. So the sooner you tell him, the sooner he can stop trying to kill me. Okay, so where is he now and I'll talk to him? Uh, actually... That's a good question. Time to teach Drift a lesson. Looks like your date's about to go down a bomb, Drift. <laughs> Take this. I thought you were my best friend, Drift. I can't believe you do something like this. You know how much I liked her. Wait, Deadpool, you've got it all wrong, I told you. 
I was never trying to hook up with Vix. This is a big misunderstanding. Tell him, Vix. Yeah, Deadpool. Drift was trying to tell me how you felt, but I misunderstood and thought he was talking about himself. Drift was never trying to hook up with me. Ah, uh, he wasn't? No. As soon as I kissed Drift, he told me that we could never be together because you guys are friends. I told you, Deadpool. I'd never do that. I'm sorry, Drift. I should have believed you. I guess it's true what they say. Love really can make you blind. Wait, did you just say you loved me? Ah, uh, yeah. How could I not? You're the most smart and beautiful girl I've ever met. That's the nicest thing anybody has ever said to me. Is it bad that maybe I want to kiss you? <laughs> Are you kidding? I can't think of anything I'd want more. So I guess everything worked out. And it looks like you win the bet, Deadpool. I owe you a thousand V-Bucks. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, you're telling me that all of this, everything that just happened, was because of some stupid bet? Uh-oh, it's not what you think, Fix. I can't believe I even thought about going on a date with you. I'm out of here. No, Fix, wait. Oh, man, me and my big mouth.